Hello everybody and welcome to Mudrunner. I spin tiles going with me, yo-yo. And there's only so much you can do with the maps on Mudrunner and there's only so many uh, so many times you can play the maps on Mudrunner on the base game. And I know I'm all against mods. Well, I'm not against mods, but you know, my challenge to myself was to do a game with no mods. But I got impatient waiting for American Wild. So it's about 10, 11 days away. So we're going to single player and we're going to play on Longfall. Now, yes, I did do a little bit, and literally, it's going to be a hard work and a half because I've already I've tried this map twice, and I've tipped my jeep over, and it's been unrecoverable. I've stalled the engine, can't use a winch, can't do nothing, and I'm just sat there like a div. So I'm going to go for it again. So I'm going to start the new game me in hardcore on Longfall, uh, a map by Torridon 88, I do believe, if I remember rightly. Correct me if I'm wrong. Let's do it. Start a new game in hardcore. Yeah, it doesn't matter if I've lost it. I've lost that game anyway. Tipping me truck over. Alright, let's get the old four wheel drive on now. I tipped my truck over pretty much on these two trees here on my right hand side. And then I got to the river. And there's a little bit by the river, and I stack my truck just there as well. So it is challenging, believe you me. But that's what I wanted, and I've got what I asked for. So straight away, stuck on trees. Can we just push our way through? I think we can. Let's see if we can get this way. There we go, we're through. So I tip my truck there, and I also tip my truck further down on that river. There's a little ledge I wanted to get to, and I uh, had a bit of a, a tumble and a roll there as well. I stalled my truck, and that was the end of that. So this is uh, hopefully third time lucky I can get somewhere with this truck. Maybe get to that first watch point. Maybe get to the fuel station, that would be my uh, a Brucey bonus. Oh, steady, steady. Oh. Now, I tipped my truck over somewhere down here. So I'm going to go steady. See, look at that, see. I'm not going to tip my truck here for the third time, believe you me. Well, not here, I tipped it here the first time. The second time I didn't get past the two trees on the right-hand side. Driving two feet away from where I started. Right, so... It's a game where you can't go uh, Speedy Gonzales in. Let's just check out. There is the road there that goes down to there. So uh, I believe this truck is a bit top heavy with uh, the little garage or repair points he's got on the roof. Now I don't know if I'm going to make this. Is this a wise idea? Well, there's only one way to find out in there. There's only one way to find out and just do it. So we're moving still, we're still moving slowly, slowly. Let's see if we can get to that other side, get to that first watch point. Some trees just up on the left hand side, so if I need a winch I will try and get to that. Have I come to a stop? I'm slowly, slowly edging my way. How about if I put some diff lock on? That's not going to do nothing. How about a winch? Is there a possibility of a winch of something? No, not a thing in sight. So it's just a case of uh, cracking on, cracking on. Um. So we can 
go backwards. Now, let's see if we can go upriver a little bit here. Okay, so let's have a rethink. How about going over that grass, maybe? That's probably not going to do us any justice either, I believe, but hey. That's what it's all about, isn't it? Oh, let's get it in the gear. Right, is this a good place to cross? Let's just do it and test it and see. Well, I certainly did better than the last time. Yay, this is good stuff, good stuff. Right, where's that? Uh trucks over getting up to watch point because I know they're not going to be easy. It seems like whatever you do to avoid a tree you hit a tree. So um, oops, let's put this into automatic for the time being. Okay, woohoo, let's have a look see what that's revealed then. It's revealed quite a bit down the bottom here. A lot of curly whirly roads. And we've got a B66. So I think that is our mission. Now, I'm not sure if it's safe to come down here or should we just follow the, uh, the route round to the fuel station and then get that B56. Oh, we've got a B-130 just down here as well. Okay, and then what's our next watch, watch point? I don't know, it looks like a nice big river that flows through here. Although it does get a bit slimmer there, so... Uh, well, let's just crack on. I think we need to... I don't know if there's a shortcut down here. That looks like a little stream of some kind, but that could be... That could be worse than first thought, couldn't it? to get onto this road. Shall we give it a go? Uh, shall we give it a go? So we put a little pointers about. Let's have a look. We don't need that second one. Let's put this... In fact, we don't need any of them. So we just want to look right to this road, which is just here. Now we can evaluate the terrain when we get to it. River right in front of me. Yeah, and I just. Is there a way? There. Now that does look a bit rough and ruddy over that way as well, doesn't it? Oh, we're going to do it. Oh, a little bit of a stream here. I don't think this is a good idea this way. Look, that's a bit too steep for this bad boy. I think we're going to have to go the other way. We're going to have to go the river way, or the puddle way, or whatever you want to call that in front of us. Seems like, where's the track gone? Just over here. Plenty of rock. 
rocks just jump all over now. Trees, rocks. Well, they weren't wrong that this is going to be a challenge. And I certainly gave myself a challenge. There's like a nice rickety bridge over there, look. Ready to uh, put yourself onto if you get stuck anywhere. I suppose that's all part of the challenge as well. Well, so far I'm loving the challenge. Well, we're still moving steadily. I think we're going to use all our fuel up just getting to the fuel station. But you can't go tearing about because uh, that's what I did in the first attempt really. I drove a bit too fast and hit a bump. Roll my truck. Let's get around that rock. We don't want to see you go around that rock, do we? If we can help it. Don't mind the smaller rocks, but not these bigger ones. Is that a good idea going this way? You want to tip this bad boy over. Oh, 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 oh. There we go, back on the track. Let's uh So I'm gonna be checking in and about the map a lot, so let's get rid of that. We don't need that. Where are we? So we're over there, come through here, through another little river. Where's that little bridge? There was a bridge over here somewhere, weren't it? That looked interesting. Or was it over this road? I don't know, I can't remember. Mm -hmm. So we'll get to this fuel station, get to this B66, and then we can, well, I think the fuel station might be able to sneak down here. You say that, you don't know what the terrain's like yet, do we? So, we're poodling through it, we're poodling through it, we've got further than we have in my first two attempts of trying to do this. see the fuel station. As long as we don't tip the truck. Oh, scare me, scare me. Just don't tip that truck. Over. I don't too bad for fuel at the moment, no, I'll be honest with you. Used what, a quarter of a tank since I get this far from our starting position. I'm going to top it up anyway. fill up that then because you never know what we might see 80 litres it's not a lot but I might get a truck or something going but it's alright fine in the trucks but they might need repairing they might need fuel so 
So let's go over this way and get that B66. I do believe it's over this way. Let's just have a double check. Yeah. Doesn't look far on the map, but it is far. Yeah, oh, you're joking me, look. Come on, yeah, get going. Are we stuck, stuck? Are we moving? Okay, so we uh, try and winch onto this tree, but I don't want this tree to pull us over. Anything else to winch on other than that tree? Absolute zilch. We've got this one over here, that might be able to help us out a little bit. Oops, I thought I got it there, didn't quite get it to die. There we go. Yeah, it's a bit all topsy turvy roads. And there's a B-56 up here. How would you get the thing up here is the question. Careful, just because it looks like downhill and you can put a bit of speed on. Look at these bumps. And the last thing I want to do is roll down that hill. No, that's uh, not good. Because I'm also playing on a hardcore as well, so if I lose my truck, I lose my truck. I've got to rescue it. And believe you me, I've had some rescue missions. I'm sure all of us have. So here we go. I found a truck. So let's um, have a switch truck and see what the... Oh, this ain't too bad. It's got a bit of fuel, no damage. Oh, change truck. Okay. Oh, I'm still in this thing, ain't I? Hang on, let's change truck. There we go. Oh, see, it's got not too much fuel in it, which is not too bad. About just over half a tank and a little bit of damage. So we could go and get this fueled up. Um, it's got some garage points on the back of this thing as well, hasn't it? Has that some garage points? And little trailers. Right, let's go and get some fuel in this. how this is going to handle compared to that Jeep but we're already stuck. <sighs> now we've got to haul some logs on this yet. That's going to be interesting isn't it? I'm not too sure if I like the in-cab view or not, to be honest with you. I haven't quite made my mind up in all the time that I've been playing Mud Runner. It's not too bad, to be honest with you. Alright, let's get this topped up with fuel and then we'll uh, have a think about our next plan of action. Because we've got to plan things on this map, I do believe. We can't just go for it. stuck. Oh no, I think we're creeping slowly. Look, according to that wheel on that trailer, it looks like we're creeping slowly. Oh, 
let's get some fuel in this bad boy then. Add-ons for fuel capacity installed. Okay, okay. All right. So, what's our next plan of action then? So, it doesn't look like we can get to the left, does it? Looks like we can get to the left. Hang on, let's have a little look. That doesn't look too feasible that way, does it? Looks like a drop of some kind. So, we can't go that way, which is what I kind of wanted to do. Or if we can, I can't see it. And I think the best plan of action is uh, come down here to this river, and go around, and find this B30. That is what I. That looks like it's on the side of a hill, doesn't it? That looks quite scary. Yeah, I think coming down here along this river or whatever this white thing might well be, a stream, around here. To get that B130, it's got one garage point, 127. Yeah, so we're not doing too bad. So we leave this thing here, or should we? Where's the garage? It's up there. Oh, there's one down here, which we might be able to do on our way round. Could be a cross in here. Okay, so we're going to take this bad boy. Um, it's not going to be easy reversing this little diddly trailer, but we're going to reverse out of here. Just a bit of Euro truck. Oh, don't tip over you. Oh, scaring me. Keep it going, keep it going. Okay, and then let's go and get me up with our Jeep. Well, there's a pathway up there, I don't know where that leads to. It leads to uh, somewhere, maybe that little bridge that's there, maybe. We want to try and get a garage unlocked at least, don't we? We might not be able to get that done in this episode. But if we can uh, at least unlock this and the B131, I will be happy. So let's uh, try and winch ourselves out. If at all possible. He says, uh, we did this one another time, didn't we? So, just following suit of what we did with the Jeep. And we're out, let's uh, undo that. Now, let's. Uh, wait. Let's go and get beat up with our Jeep. I think we might use a Jeep as our scout vehicle and then let this vehicle follow through. All oh, steady. Looked like it wanted to get a bit of speed up there. We can't afford any drops. Yeah, let's see if we can get this other truck unlocked today in this episode. That'll be a result, and hopefully in the next episode we might be able to unlock a garage. Depends. I think you need four points to unlock a garage. If that's one point in the back of this and one point on that B131, then um, all right. So we dump this here and jump into our jeep. So let's uh, switch the engine off, change truck. Let's get in here. Is that 131? Right, so we want to get to about there, I think, and then turn right. So, I might just turn right up this little dirt track here. I think that could well be a dirt track then. Come on, 
don't get stuck. Alright. Ah, result that was. How handy was that one? Okay, so we've got some kind of track here. Hopefully the bomb 3 one is just round this corner. This round has no fuel in it. So we want to go down here then, don't we? What's that to my right? No, let's just follow this road round. Because I'm on a road, but I can't... Let's get that rid of that. I'm on a road, but I don't think I am on a road. Am I going to get onto this road? Or is this just this gravel bit? And uh, This looks like a hill. So I don't know if this is probably better... Coming down here and through this forest, maybe. Oh, well, we'll just have to see. Let's see what it's like. Oh, hey, hey, there's the 131. So, it's a hidden roads, then, is it? Let's have a look and see what this has got then. Okay, so let's uh, change truck to the B1. I thought it was a B131. I found a B130. It's got fuel in the back, so how much fuel has it got? It's got 286. And it's got some repair points as well. I don't know how this is going to get on getting out of here. And it said it had garage points as well, did it? Let's just uh, yeah. Right, oops. Let's uh, see how we get on getting this bad boy out of here then. I think this thing might need a bit of towing after a bit of while. Don't get too close to that edge. So it's not got much damage and it's got quite a bit of fuel in it, so it's got no four-wheel drive, no diff lock. Oh my life, is that the only tree I can get hold of? Tree now, yeah, we can. It's taking us off the track though, which is not what I really want. I think this thing is going to need. Whoa, 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 whoa! I think what this thing is going to need is a tow. Because I don't think I'm going to get this anywhere, to be honest with you. I could be wrong, because it seems to be... Come on, go, go, go. Go, go, go. Um, winch. Absolutely nothing. Uh, 
Seriously, nothing. Nothing. Slowly, here yeah, we got out of that. Beautiful. Okay, I'm going to call this an episode right here. We're currently at about 31 minutes on the game. I want to try and keep all the episodes to around 30 minutes. But we've accomplished what I wanted to do, and that is to rescue the B66 and the B130, even though I thought it was a B131, but it doesn't matter. And all we've got to do is just get this thing out of here, get the jeep back out of here and see if we can find a garage, find some more trucks, unlock a garage. And that's going to be a non-continuing thing. Then we'll do some logging once we've got everything all done with us. I think we're a long way away from logging just at the moment. All the prep work has got to go into getting everything all sorted out and the routes and blah blah blah. So anyway, I'm rabbiting on. Hit like if you want to hit like, hit subscribe if you want to subscribe. And I hope to see you next time. Thank you very much for watching.